Previously on The Witcher 2, the gem we found was actually a crystallized dream harvested by harpies, but this dream wasn't powerful enough, so we had to go into the harpy cave to find a more powerful dream gem. In the cave, we actually found a lot more harpies, oddly enough, but we also found the dream gem of the dragon who attacked Geralt earlier. We also headed into the mist and killed Vandergriff, who is in the form of a draug, in order to lift the battlefield curse. Hinsult attacked Vergen shortly after we lifted the curse, but pretty promptly got owned. We also found out that Ska Saskia is a fucking dragon. Saskia and Philippa accepted Hinsult's surrender, but Yorvith noticed that Saskia was acting very strange. So he and I followed them to Philippa's house, but they teleported shortly before they went inside. We decided to search Philippa's quarters, and we found a journal about poison with evidence that Philippa actually altered the antidote so that she could control Saskia. Now Igorvith and Geralt head to Loch Moine, where a council is to be held and where Philippa and Saskia can be found. Also in Loch Moine, Triss has been reverted to normal by a sorceress whose services are paid for in stabs. Also, this happens. And now, back to The Witcher 2, currently in progress. Hello folks and welcome to the Vertigo Tea Party and let's play The Witcher 2. I'm actually recording this seconds after I ended the last session. I'm gonna play for well, a good bit longer if I can. I'm actually running out of disk space. I need a third 2 terabyte hard drive. Or a third 2 terabyte external hard drive, as crazy as that might sound. Uh-oh. What's up guys? Nice armor. I think. It's hard to tell. It's kind of dark. And hopefully I get some new armor very, very soon. I'm very Knights excited to make that. Rose at a piece really? I Those guys? On. on that of whoever paid them. Any idea who might have summoned them? Radovid. Now the scum of the Order wear the Redanian coat of arms as they burn pyres. Witch hunts are their favorite pastime. Or so I've heard. Radovid witnessed what the Order did in Vizima. He saw the Grand Master's madness with his own eyes. Yet he gave them a new home. For a good reason, I expect. That's easy. He needed a whip against Isleheart. They've made camp outside the city walls. Means they're not here in an official capacity. Are they on vacation? Maybe they just don't want to stand out. Isleheart has a dragon up her sleeve. Radovid has invited a unit of the Order's Knights. Don't forget Sheila and Henselt. It should be an interesting piece. <laughs> yeah. You shouldn't let them see you. I know. To them, a good elf is a dead elf. I agree. It's oh. not because you're an elf. It's because you're Yorvith. I'll and because you're an elf. the city through the caves. I'd advise you to do the same. I know the Order's Grand Master. We once fought on the same side. I'll talk to him. Count me out. I'll try to find the caves that connect to the city sewers. Oh, that sounds we'll fun. We'll meet inside Loch Mween. Catch up to me if you change your mind. That fail. I'm gonna assume that was something good. He didn't say in Elvish, go fuck yourself. Oh, follow you over or take a look at the Order's camp. Well, I kind of... I want to take a look at the camp. I mean, I don't want the situation where it's like, oh, well, you didn't choose side with me. Well, fuck you. I hope that's not the case. Okay. All critical effects, 15%. Unfortunately, the the uh, instant kill is not considered a critical effect, which that's fair enough. That would be pretty damn broken, I think, if it was. All right, let's save it. I, I want to check the camp out. I mean, I like Yorvith. I mean, as much as you can like Yorvith. But I just want to check the camp out. Halt! Drop your sword. I know you. You're the Witcher of Rivia. You murdered. Leave him. But Grandmaster. Hey, it's enough. The dude. Leave us alone. Welcome, Witcher. Hello again. I remember you. Siegfried of Denel. Glad to see you, Grandmaster. Might as well ham it up. As am I to see you. Hmm. So tell me, what are your knights doing at a peace summit? I owe you much, Geralt, and by the gods I'm on your side. But there are things of which I simply cannot speak. I heard you're in trouble. Sort of. I've come to Loch Muin to get out of it. 
There's quite a price on your head. Letters and orders have been issued, bounties offered. Do you believe I've been killing kings? You never do anything without good reason. And I fail to see how you would profit from plunging the North into chaos. You're right on those counts. You've probably been camped here for a while, so you must know if Philippa Eilhart is in Loch Mwing. She was just arrested and charged with high treason. Oh, holy I shit. Know. Radovid signed the order. My men, along with some Redanian guards, captured her. Have the talks begun? They started this morning. Yesterday, all the delegations were busy situating themselves, their armies, courts, and servants. They're all defensive, wary of threats, and there's protocol to keep in mind. As a result, heavily armed units patrol most streets while the rulers sit enclosed in their quarters until it's time to deliberate when they venture out at the head of small armies. The air is thick, Witcher, and my men wager two to one that we shall see action by sundown at the latest. The main talks, when will they begin? The next meeting will decide the fate of the Pontar Valley and whether the Council and Conclave will be re-established. If that's what you ask about. That's precisely what I wanted to know. I'm glad the Order of the Flaming Rose survived. Hey. In no small part thanks to you, Witcher. We've only just planted roots in Redania, thanks largely to Radovid's grace. He promised us land near Rogavine, and I aim to erect a fortified castle there. The largest fortress in the north. Barrienmerg, we shall call it. You'll hear of it soon. Oh. You should have named it after me. Come on, guys. I want a castle named after myself. You look worried. A Grand Master bears great responsibility. What's your responsibility at a peace summit? Nobody believes in a peaceful resolution to these talks. Even Radovid? Radovid has great plans and few or no scruples. A true monarch. Other kings are priestesses of Melitele compared to him. When did the Order of the Flaming Rose jump in bed with the Redanians? When Radovid granted us land. The Order's Supreme Council has sworn allegiance to him. Now we're his personal guard. Mm. Interesting move for such a young king. Good for both sides, really. The Order needed a place to call its own, and Radovid had droves of opponents, most of whom we've already rendered harmless. After Vizimir's death, practically everyone tried to tear off a piece of the realm for themselves. Precisely. The young king now strives to consolidate his power. He's a capable and very ambitious man. I have to talk to Philippa. She's in a dungeon in the Redanian camp. No one's allowed inside. Just let me in through the gate. I'll take care of the rest. Now, oh, come right. on. But be careful. The city's like a witch's bomb. One spark and... Don't worry about me. Where's the Redanian camp? You must find the central square. I'd advise you to stay clear of the other camps, especially the Temerian one. They still believe you slew their king. Like the other delegations, they've barricaded themselves in one of the city quarters. Hmm. Radovid occupies several buildings on the eastern wall of the square. Quite easy to defend, I might add. Good luck, Witcher. I vouch for this man. Treat him as the Order's guest. I'm giving him my ring. Yes, Grandmaster. We'll alert all patrols. The city's crawling with armed men. It's been divided into several sectors to avoid conflict. Each has its own guards who keep the peace. Don't start any fights or use magic and all should be well. You just called my very existence into question. I'm merely warning you. May the eternal fire guide you, Witcher. All right. Yeah, I really want to say what Philippa has to say for herself. You got some explaining to do. So maybe she's been. Oh, what the? You bastard. You beat me here. Impressive. Hmm. It's a bunch of red dots. You're not gonna say anything, Yorvith? Not gonna mock? Like, oh, I got it before you. You smell like sewage, so. Eh. Uh, I'd say I won that one. They gagged Philippa in the nick of time. She almost cast a spell. Rotting in the Redanian dungeon now in special shackles. Radovid's right to show the witches their place. I wonder what they'll do to her. Either the execution or the monsters will have their fun. They say Logmuin's dungeons are full of scum of all kinds. No idea what they locked her up for, but every sorceress is guilty of something. Uh, True enough. Not likely to see anyone weeping for her. 
Humans are a dungeon befits Philippa Eilhart very well, though gallows would be even better. If they kill her, you can forget about healing Saskia. They must guard her as heavily as the Emperor's bedchamber. We'll not get in there. I'm in no hurry to visit the Emperor's bedchamber, but we've got to get into the dungeon. Look for a passage through the sewers. I'll locate Eilhart's quarters. If she didn't expect to be arrested, I may find something interesting there. The tunnels beneath the city sound reasonable. They used to lead almost everywhere, though some passages may have collapsed during the fires. It's still worth a shot. Let's go then. I'll find Philippa. You search her quarters. Right. We learned a lot the last time we browsed through her things. Va fail, Gwynblade. I feel like that's a mixed thing. Va fail, Gwynblade. It feels like he's like... Good luck. Cracker boy. Like, it feels like he's he's doing a little bit of both. Reach the imprisoned Philip Philippa Garnhart to the sewers and get the guard's attention. Well, I definitely don't want their attention. What the bloody fuck? What the fuck is going on? Wait, stop. Wait, what the hell? Why did you... What the hell? <laughs> okay. It's like, oh, I just don't want to fight anymore. Interesting animation bug there. Like, I just put my weapon away for no reason. I don't know why that was about. Oh, that was pricks. Don't block me, you dick one. Oh yeah. Suck it. Now it's just you out. Um <laughs> What was that about? Come on. What? It's two again, really? Is that how we're gonna play this? Those guys, those guards don't notice like the sound of Oh, so they blow up. That's good to know. Shit. Okay. Can I loot them? Elemental stone. Ooh, nice. Gargoyle dust. Sweet. Gargoyle heart. I actually need that for something. I don't remember what it is. How's this over here? Nice. Dead guy. Take the orange. Magical danger. I'll take either. Wait. Let's check something real quick. I don't think this is what it looks like. Oops. My bad. Nope. There we go. Nope, okay. Let's so just keep that sword out, shall we? Probably for the best. Uh, and of course, we'll probably be fighting shit. Of course, I can. There we go. I think it was because I was walking through a door. It didn't like me trying to meditate there. Uh, Rook, of course. Swallow, we'll take our last swallow of swallow. Aha! After drinking this, our critical effect chance should be pretty high, given our talents and uh, the potions effects. We'll check it. Come on, Geralt. Now, can we make more swallow? Probably not. We don't have a lot of stuff on us. Actually, we can. Wow, nice. I'm not going to make a whole lot. Just because it's not that useful anymore. The health regen is so slow. Let's go with Quinn. Let's go with Quinn. And let's check our attributes. Freeze 6%, incinerate 27, bleeding 23. That's still pretty, not very good. Maybe it's not factoring in the sword. Oh, Jesus. 
Not expecting that. Keep stabbing him in the back. Keep him stunned. Stab in the back. It actually does say stab in the back at the bottom right. Get away. No, it didn't explode. Looked like he wanted to, though. Elemental. Ooh, elemental trophy. I don't think we've got one of those yet. Let's check it out. Uh, let's see. Vitality 15. Damage bonus on signs. Yeah, no thanks. Harpy trophy. No. Okay. Get the best trophy. That looks bad. Oh wait, are these are the signs we have to use? Mm. That sort of looks like Oh, extinguish. What does this do? Oh. oh I thought we had to like figure it out. We just run up to it and left click. It's my kind of puzzle. I wonder if there's a specific order we have to do them in. Like, once we do this one... Ouch! Ah, uh, it is. Ow! And you poisoned me. Wow, thanks, prick. Alright, is there any... Examine. Fourth encrypted rune combination. Behold the comet. It is like a wolf in times of scarceness and evil lullaby. What? Is there any anything else to read? Uh, hmm. so let's read this again. Behold, the comet is like a wolf in scarceness. Nothing looks like a wolf or a comet. None of them also really look like the signs. Our signs, or the uh, Mr. Signs. That one, actually, that one kind of does look like uh, Yurden. Sort of. Like the bottom's missing, but. Hmm. I'll tell you what, let me think about this puzzle, and I'll pick you back up. Okay, so actually, I get the impression that we're not supposed to be here yet. Well, first of all, it says fourth encrypted room combination, so I would leads me to believe that there's three others. And I don't see any way that we'd be able to figure this out. Like, obviously, I could be missing something. I don't doubt that. But um, so I started looking at it, and then I realized, wait a minute, there's no door in here. At first, I was thinking, like, there was a door over here or something. Or that when I open it, or then maybe when I fix... Come on. Mouth. Let's do this. When I did the right combination, not only would the chest become unlocked, but a door would open. But then I started thinking, that seems kind of weird. It doesn't. Usually that doesn't happen. Usually it's like one or the other. So I started looking around, and I'm pretty sure you're actually not supposed to go over here. I'm supposed to go all the way around. I thought, I know the arrow is way up north. But I thought that, well, maybe, oh shit. That's right, we can scoot over here. They don't see us. Oops, put our sword away. See if we can talk to these people. Yes. Let's play dice. You must first defeat my teacher. He's a master of magic, but grossly my inferior when it comes to dice. Okay. I'm gonna guess these people. How can I help? I want to play dice. You must first prove you're good enough by defeating the elves who play here. Oh jeez. Uh, I don't really do want to do the elf do that right now. So let's go around here. And when I went over here, oh, there's a dog down there. Leave him alone. Because we want to get around those guards. And I don't, I don't know if we can get around all of them. But I end up having to fight a few. But it wasn't like auto-lose or anything, so. Which I, because I thought what was going to happen, the way the quest is worded, I thought, oh, well, the minute I get caught, the guards are going to, like, carry me away. Because... Remember that before there was that option when you were talking to Yorvith to get yourself captured? So I thought, well, maybe you get the guards on your case and then you, you know, get captured and whatnot. But I'm pretty sure it's not what we're going to do. 
Like, maybe that was just a one-time thing. Even though the quest still says, or get their attention. So I don't know why we would get their attention, but I don't really want to do it that way. I want to do it relatively legit. Who are these people?